Hello MechWarriors, how's it going? And welcome to your daily dose of MechWarrior Online, where we are playing the champion today. There was a question on my Twitch streams, um, and the question was, what would be a viable low tonnage mech for a heavy Gauss rifle? And I was like, debating it with the Twitch community, and uh, the people were already saying, yeah, the grid iron is good for that, you have a 50 tonner, it's a very low tonnage mech that is still viable. But you know what? I would go up to the 60 ton bracket, because here we have the champion, and the champion is beautiful for it. Why? Because we have one ballistic hard point and a good chunk of energy hard points as well. And that kind of synergizes very, very well. I will talk about that in a second. So first of all, we are running a standard engine because we need the slots for the heavy Gauss rifle. So no light engine possible, no XL engine possible, sadly. But um, the heavy Gauss is on our right shoulder and we have five medium lasers on the left side and the center combined. The cool thing about this here is that our heavy Gauss rifle deals 25 damage. That's quite respectable. And we have a a heat buildup of only two. And with the 11 heat sinks that we have here, we have a big surplus of uh, heat management. And we're gonna use that with very weight efficient energy weapons on top of that. The five medium lasers deal a respectable damage of additional 25 damage. So our alpha strike is 50 now, and they are just soaking up all the heat um, that our heat management brings to the table. And it kind of balances it out quite nicely. Also, our nominal fighting, our optimal fighting distance is about 300 meters on the medium lasers and on the heavy Gauss rifle. And on top of that, this champion here has a lot of armor quirks, so it is beautiful for that. It's just great. When you take a look at that here, down here, you can see the left torso has plus 10, the center torso has plus 12, and the right torso has plus 10. So it can also soak up a good chunk of damage. We are running three and a half tons of ammo, as I was saying. One extra heatsink on top of the 10 that come with the engine. It's a very straightforward build. And by the way, you will probably see me firing my lasers first and charging my Gauss rifle up at the same time. So I'm basically pressing both mouse buttons at the same time. And as soon as the lasers have stopped firing, as soon as they are done, then the charge up is ready for the heavy gauss and I can release the button. So it's kind of a good indicator. Also, you don't want cockpit shake from the heavy gauss. So shooting the lasers first and then following up with the heavy gauss and then getting that crazy cockpit shake is the best way to play that, I would say. Let me take a look at the skills before we get into the games here. And as you can see, we have gotten the laser duration nodes as well as magazine capacity 1 and 2. I don't think that I need the gauss charge nodes. It's a thing that I can pretty much get away with without because, um, you know, I kind of know when to shoot and when not to and when to charge and I don't need to hold it for a long time because, uh, again, I, I'm pretty okay with the heavy Gauss rifle in terms of charge up time and then know the timings there. So if you have enough practice, you can skip those and put them into something that gives you a passive bonus instead of helping you with your active skills. We also have the left side of the survivability tree to get extra armor on the mech and armor specifically because the heavy Gauss rifle has an explosion chance and uh, when it's getting destroyed, it will rip your side torso apart and deal a good chunk of damage to your center torso as well. And um, therefore, we're gonna try to shield it from critical damage and that's the best, the best way to do that is with the armor hardening. We also get a bit of cool run here because our lasers, we have five of them, they will generate heat over time and we only have 11 heat sinks so we need a bit of artificial cooling on top of that. We have rated deprivation for some defensive maneuvers and I was going for double artillery and a cool shot today. And that is the build everybody. I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming now and as always if you have that don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel for more and now it's time to hit the battlefield. All right, first game of the day. We are playing Domination on the Canyon Network. We have our five lasers on the left side, the heavy gauss on the right. I'm not going to shoot it right now because I only have 24 shots and I want to keep them. I mean, I want to get rid of them, but only if I can actually hit my enemies. So no waste of ammo. That's what I want to say. Also, we have two assault mechs, one of which is a Blood Asp, the other one is a Mad Cat Mark IIb. I would say those are very good mechs to have here. Seems also that we are relatively mobile as a team, so I don't see any big sluggish mechs. And that means that it's probably gonna unfold in, you guessed it right, a NASCAR. So, let's see. AMS on the Hellfire, that's good to have. He's also running a Gauss PPC? No, it's just a, the, the big laser stick that's coming out there. Super crazy. But yeah, we are in a position where we can actually start the fight. The question is, where are our enemies? Can we find them? Blood Asp is running ECM, so that's helpful. Thank you very much for that. And man, I want to stay on the left side, honestly. I really want to do that. Shall we, shall we counter Nesca, like left side? Uh-huh, yes, no, maybe. Ooh, there's a guy in the center. Let's go. Zip and boom. Got him. Did I? No, wait. Did I? I think I did. Maybe I didn't. 
So yeah, we're gonna stay here for a second. Problem is, uh, snapshots are not really possible because we have to uh, charge up our Gauss rifle. Um, hard strike. Nope, 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 nope. Yeah, I mean, we are actually holding the counter NASCAR position here. I love it. I really do like it. Gonna drop Artie Strike down there. Yeah. No! What? Um, can we can we hold it here, guys? We, we can definitely hold this. Great artillery strike. I like it. There we go. Now we got him. No, no, he twisted away. That's so unfortunate. That's so crazy. Uh, no, cannot go for it. Don't have a clear shot. Now I have. Yes! And another Artie Strike. I'm gonna stay on the Black Knight. And we got him. Perfect. Another Black Knight coming. I mean, we got a lot of armor ourselves. Got that dude. Um, problem is heat and enemies. We have a lot of them here. <laughs> Alrighty. So, three and two. Just hold it, guys. Get the Nova Cat. Nova Cat in the bottom. Uh, I'm gonna go for Charlie. Gonna get that side torso and or the arm off, ideally. Just cripple him right now. Uh, I'm gonna eat that. I can. I cannot anymore because now I'm overheating. Oh. <laughs> so, yeah, get Charlie. Get him. Good job. Keep it up, guys. We have that flank. We cannot completely hold it here. Oh, I love that counter NASCAR. I like Mac behind us. Let's try to get that dude. And that is him pinned down. I love it. I love when that happens. And I love when I cannot get the follow up shot. <laughs> but that's okay. So we are down to 13 shots. Let's push over. Absolutely. This is where we're gonna be aggressive now. Gotta be careful, not getting shot too much from that whatever that was. Yep, that's a hit. Uh, missiles coming. What about the light mech there? I wonder what it is. Um, also, do I need to help against the Stormcrow? Probably not. And another pin. I don't know. Seems like I, I hit him, but I don't know if I hit him properly. God, he's taking so much damage. Still, I really wonder where the long shot came from. From behind? It might have been. Oh, wait, there's a guy. Oh, there are multiples. Let's go for them. Yeah, it seems to be a Corsair and something else. Something light-ish. What about you, Hellfire? You're getting struck, buddy. Careful. Um, also, I don't have that much armor anymore. Maybe I shouldn't be that aggressive here. Can I help here? Nope, I cannot. But I want to help down here in a Charlie 3. Uh, hey, Cyborg, I'm going to push. You coming with me? Oh, come on! Didn't charge it to full. <laughs> Corsair, where did he go? He should be here somewhere. He couldn't have gone far, honestly. Right leg critical damage. Right leg critical damage. That's fine. Did you kill the Corsair already? Where did he go? Where did he go? He oh, there him. he is. Okay, got him. Behind? What? How did he get there? I was completely blind. Didn't even see him. All right, let's see. Uh, it was a miss. Uh, we're gonna probably stay here. Because my friends are doing the job just fine. Cool. And now we're gonna push a bit. Because at that point, uh, we, we have the angle. I was waiting for my cooldown to be ready. And that's it. Five shots left. We won the video game. We took a lot of damage here. And I do believe we also did some. So yeah, I'd say, I think yeah. like 600. 600 is possible. Yeah. Oh, with the Arty Strikes, eight. 800. Come on. Tell me, game. Uh, 667, all right. I kind of uh, <clears throat> misassessed um, the situation there. But anyway, one damage too much. We only got, uh, only, we got two killing blows. We got three killmost damage dealt. Nonetheless, we got eight assists with 355 taken and three components destroyed. And that was the first round. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. All right, second game of the day. We are playing Assault on the Solaris City. Guys, this is going to be extremely good for us because we have a very structured map. We can... Why are you stopping? Uh, we we can come around the corner with the Gauss Rifle Charge and then release it very quickly. So um, exposure time is going to be minimal here unless we get into a nice open field brawl. Also, um, it's okay if I'm going to drop here. We decided to go to the left side. We're going to go for a counter NASCAR approach here, going to Echo 5. And um, I want to see what we can do there. Sadly, uh, sadly, sadly, we are not on the other side. So going to Echo 6 is also pretty good from, from the other side, not, not from our position here. But yeah, this here is a bit more structured, which means we got to find our gaps to actually shoot our enemies. And it seems like I'm the one to engage first. Haha, <laughs> that is good. Alrighty. So let's go for the very hated black and white vision. Um, I'm, getting, I'm getting a lot of comments lately again. There's a guy. 
Mm hmm Okay. Hello, Hellfire. I don't have ECM, right? No, I don't. Okay, cool. So, where did he go? There he is. Goodbye. Oh, ATMs? This is gonna hurt. Unless we can break line of sight, which we just did. Perfect. Let's kill this guy. Let's actually get the kill on this guy. Hmm. Ah, what? No. Did I hit... Did I... Ah, the billboard. The billboard. Billboard Baggins. Damn it. Damn it, billboard. What are you doing? Okay. I want to hunt him. I want to see what I can do. Enemies are most likely in the center. A lot of them. And this one Hellfire here. Yeah, he was running. You can see he's actually overcharging his masks. His legs are damaged. Here's a guy right beneath us. Um, want to hit him? That's an arm down. An arm is not much here in that situation. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm dropping. I need to get another shot out. Super important right now. Oh, yeah, please. More of that. I'm gonna follow. Yes. Follow, follow, follow. Nope. Stuck. Bad. And I couldn't get him. So, I want the Thunderbolt. Echo 5 in the center. Mm. Also, I want to intimidate those guys. So, I dropped a Gauss on those guys. And I dropped artillery on those guys. And the Thunderbolt is basically down. So, yeah, that's fine. Ooh. Uh, is that a guy? I'm gonna just shoot randomly. I will probably hit something. Get the Hellfire, bravo. That is a kill. Cool. Uh, left side Echo 5 is hot, guys. Watch that. Ooh, also, right side is hot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. It's fine. Let me load. Leave me load. No, no, no. I want to help. I don't need to help. My friend is fine. You see, though? So, let's see. Hello. That is bad. We gonna go. No, 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 no. <laughs> this is not my fight here. Um, so, yeah. We are actually getting surrounded, which is not good. Wanna peek? I think I, that was a miss there. Um, we had to go. It's really hard to find a spot now, but I think we have a push going on here. So, guys, Echo 5 it is. Let's go. Get the King Crab on top. Uh, which is actually a Marauder 2. Get him. Cannot move. Completely pinned. Cannot maneuver at all. People are fighting the right side. All right, I'm going to fight the left side. Bam. Take that. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Left side, guys. Delta 5. Uh-huh. That's a hit. I really like this left side, uh, right side approach there. No clear line of fire. Get him! Oh god. That guy has to go. Cannot shoot. Can't. Sorry for that. <laughs> this is so messy. Got him! Finally. So, my left side doesn't look great, but as long as my heavy gauss is there, I am happy. Yeah, that's the left side gun. All right. So, oh no, oh no, oh no, he's gonna kill me. Cannot, cannot fight him. Need to, need to break line of sight. What about you, buddy? I'm so dead. And again, cannot shoot. Now I can. Can we kill this dude? He's completely focused on somebody else. Uh, and he's now going for me, right? Yeah, this is where my gauss explodes, and this is where I go down! Ah, damn it! I mean... I mean... I mean... I mean... Do I? I think I mean. <laughs> That's a thousand damage, holy crap! What is going on here? Wow! One thousand damage coming out of this mag. I mean, I was I was taking so so much here. Yeah, we lost um, this kind of collapse here because of this left side miscoordination. We couldn't really go out there and defend both sides at the same time, and eventually we collapsed. But that is okay because I was having a blast here, literally. We got three killing moles damage dealt. We got one killing blow. We got five assists, and then a thousand and thirty nine damage done with five hundred taken and five components destroyed. Guys, that has been your daily dose for today, and I hope you enjoyed it, even though we lost. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.